Moving to automation is very difficult. I remember when I was a manual tester, right, with almost 2.96 LP at the time, right. I wanted to move towards the automation role, and I saw one of my friend who was getting double of the salary as an automation engineer. But the problem was that I was from a known IT background. I have never touched the programming language. So to move to the automation, we already know that we need a good knowledge of programming language. We have to know the live projects, and we have to know how to basically apply, and a proper job application is needed, right. So I think this is where I was stuck. and to add to that because when i was moving towards the automation the institute were charging almost 50k 30k for the simple course where i have to learn about programming language api automation and web automation so it was very difficult for me to jump into the automation at that time right so now i have 12 plus years experience guys and i think the python is one of the most popular language and one of the easiest language if you are a fresher if you are a non it and or if you are a manual tester who's thinking to jump into the automation guys automation is the need of the are and many companies right right now you see most of the projects that they are doing right they are converting their projects from manual to automation they are basically moving towards automation more so i know it is very difficult because many people have this doubt promoter i know python is a e easy language right but i have a coding fear how do i remove it right i remember exactly how i have done it so many students from the previous batches of python automation prove it basically we have taken more almost 1000 plus students have basically taken this course previously right we have done batch 1 and batch 2 already so how to remove coding fear is when you basically jump into it it is like swimming right whenever i remember when i wanted to learn swimming right you cannot learn swimming by watching the youtube videos so exactly exactly the same you go step by step the coding questions right so same thing a process basically you have to follow so only three methods basically works which is choosing the programming language and following a proper road map a road map of 3 months that i have created which we have used in python 1 1x and python 0x that exactly worked i remember the testimonial of neelam and other things who are basically successfully able to do the python automation course right so again if you are like looking for the high salary job security and good decent world right i think to move to the automation python is one of the easiest language where you can start with but the second point which is important is why you are not able to switch to automation is because you don't do live projects guys uh, that is one of the problem that i have seen where people don't do live projects they don't add anything into their resume and the third problem that i have seen mostly is after even if they do projects right they don't add to their github profiles which is very very important that you should add everything into your github profile so that you have more more visibility your resume is high Highlighted and because lot of HRs, lot of technical people who are taking your interviews, they are going to see that. So that's why exactly three months course of Python 2x batch is getting launched, which is on January. Previously, more than thousand students have already done it. In that one, we have done more than 65 hours of content in the three months. Classes are from Monday to Friday, where we will be learning daily one hour about the Python, right? Python automation plus API automation plus Selenium. Not only that, lot of people said to me, Pramod sir, but what about the manual testing? What about the API testing? With postman we have included the both of them into this but pramod sir i i understand the knowledge but what about resume fix linkedin fixes right all these things so all these things we have added into the sdclo.club where more than 3000 students can help you to get a job as a referral also so we share daily progress it's a private community whenever you join the python automation blueprint batch right sdclo.club access is already given to you where you can get basically other people will help you to get a referral which is the easiest way to get a job right so again the main Major announcement, which is Python Automation Tester Blueprint Batch 2x, which is January batch, is getting started. Guys, here we will be learning the Python from scratch. I am assuming that you have zero knowledge in Python. We are going to learn API automation. We will learn by using the REST and PyTest plus LO report plus Selenium. We are going to cover within a span of three months plus extra content that you are going to get on the SDTOR cl classes already. Okay, do click uh, on the link below where I have basically given all the details. If you have any doubt, tell me in the chat. Let's become an automation tester. in this 2024 this is my target that all of the students who are struggling right now as a manual tester right i understand your pain because i was exactly at the same point when i have started as a manual tester right so this is what i have done and i am pretty much sure you can do it too so click on the link below i'll see you there Bye -bye.